This is our pedestal vise assembly that I've been putting together for use in the shop for doing repairs, fit ups, little tweaks, all of the little miscellaneous tasks that always lead you to a vise. The base of this is a rear axle, I believe, from an 8630 John Deere. Look it up. Uh, it's the uh, axle shaft uh, that I managed to acquire through a friend of mine. Uh, so it's a very nice solid base that sets in. We have a all direction vise with pipe fittings. It's a cheap offshore made uh, vise, but it does for what we're doing. And when you break it, you replace it for not a lot of money. The line of the jaws transfers all the way down to a flat spot in the casting. So any shaft hitting or dropping doesn't go onto the concrete floor or break it. There are spots to stick your welder stinger when you're working. Set of adjustable wrenches to start as you take something apart. Coming around to the other side, I'm a right hander. So this is where my hammer is in a quick saddle. So you can get it up, work on the vise and then tuck it back down out of your hand and do what you're working on. This is a weld position again for my stinger. Quick spot to put it while I'm working on something on the vise. And right beside it is one that's at 90 degrees. So if I'm working off the end of the vise on an assembly, it falls naturally to hand. Under that, my MIG pliers. Always have to have them accessible. And then over here is another quick saddle with a pipe wrench for all of those fast moments where you want to just put burrs on a shaft and fuck up your entire bearing. Here we have an angle saddle to catch round shafts to be either trued, worked on, or work off the side, and two pipe vise grips so that they can be saddled around here or over here. The tubing bracing underneath, a heavy wall picks up the welding ground clamp nicely. It also provides a square spot where you can clamp down onto a shaft holding it on the base. The top rotates if I undo a locking collar that is right here. I'll loosen this and the entire upper assembly spins. The axle shaft is loose. You tighten it back up and it's tight. So the vise swivels in all directions. The top of the vise swivels in all directions and the axle can be placed anywhere in the shop that we want it. There's enough force here that I can barely push this over. It takes two people to get a rolling Johnson bar under it. So that's a pipe vice project put into a shop.